So this is Science North. When this was built, I was growing up. I really wanted to work there when I was a little kid because they had, they brought in like live animals like porcupines and beaver and, and they uh, had real scientists doing science stuff. And I just was totally captivated by it. Hi, I'm Jason McLennan. I'm the founder of the Living Building Challenge, CEO of McLennan Design. I tell people that my primary description is of a troublemaker. I'm a shit disturber and I like to push wherever people say you can't go. And that's what you have to do if you're interested in this idea of regeneration. With the Living Building Challenge, we say, how do we go beyond the paradigm of being less bad? And how do we create a system that is actually good? So we require in the Living Building Challenge buildings that can only be operated off of renewable energy. We don't want to just have less climate impact. We want to have no negative climate impact, no pollution. We design as if there's no limit to the resources that we have and no limit to the, to the impact we can have on a place when instead we should be using limits to inspire us to be innovative. When I created the Living Building Challenge, it was illegal in every market that I practiced in. Uh, it was uh, incredibly expensive. It was impossible to find the materials that I was basically saying you had to build with. Um, it was not a utopian standard, but pretty close in people's minds. Probably the most fulfilling thing of my career to go back to some of those colleagues and say, fuck it, you were wrong, weren't you? What if our buildings, every time we created a building or designed a new development, what if there was more life because of our intervention? That's what we should be aspiring to. That's the level that a species that has put people on the moon, for God's sakes, we should be thinking a bit more carefully about what we are doing in this place, in our home. So that is my ultimate challenge for all of us, is to figure out how the hell we do that. Thank you.